There is one thing that I live for in life where if you complain about something like an issue or a problem that you have with a game, a medium, whatever it may be for four weeks, four days, four months, seven years, eventually you shall receive. And today we may actually be receiving Red Dead Redemption 1 on PC as an accidental link just went up on the PlayStation Store. Um, this came right from Twitter and I was shocked to see this that Red Dead Redemption 1 may actually be coming to PC. So let's talk about it. Now, for those that don't know, Red Dead Redemption 1 has been a critically acclaimed game, one of the best Rockstar games ever made. And it's been out for over 14 years. It's been due for a PC port since Red Dead Redemption 2 came out, I would argue, because not a lot of people were really talking about it prior to Red Dead Redemption 2 coming out. But ever since that came out, people kept asking time and time again, when's Red Dead Redemption 1 coming to PC? Is it going to come to PC? Is it going to get some sort of treatment? And Rockstar went quiet for years now. And even though some leaks did come out after Red Dead Redemption 2, like I think a few years back, I remember a Red Dead Redemption 1 leak or like a pattern leak or something like that, some sort where the game was essentially being leaked for a PC release, but Rockstar never confirmed it, nothing ever happened, and hence that that leak was denied. Now, we actually have a proper, well, accidental leak straight from the PlayStation Store that confirms that Rockstar Games is bringing Red Dead Redemption 1 to PC. This image came straight from Twitter from a Mexican account, and it, 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 it reads like this. Experience the Western adventures that define the generation, now on PC for the first time ever. When federal agents threaten his family, former outlaw John Marston is forced to hunt down the gang of criminals he once called friends. Experience Marston's journey across the sprawling expanses of the American West and Mexico as he fights to bury his bloodstained past in the critically acclaimed predecessor to the 2018 blockbuster, Red Dead Redemption 2. Also included is Undead Nightmare, the iconic horror story that transforms the world of Red Dead Redemption into an apocalyptic fight for survival against a zombie horde. Featuring the complete single player experiences of both games, including bonus content from the Game of the Year edition, Red Dead Redemption features all the 2023 console version upgrades plus PC specific enhancements including support for increased resolutions and frame rates, multiple displays and other accessories plus, plus spatial surround sound and RDR doesn't include multiplayer content. Now, that, that last part does make sense since RDR multiplayer has been dead for ages now, even RDR online, fuck it, let's put it in there. Even though I do know that people do play RP and online, but online is just filled with cheaters the last time I played. And honestly, I'm excited for this. It's been well long overdue, and judging from the accuracy of this leak since it came straight from the PlayStation Store, I think Rockstar's announcement of an RDR PC port is imminent. I think it's going to happen either after I make this video, it could happen tomorrow, it could be next week. Maybe they'll make it a year and it'll go back to people complaining again. But nevertheless, this is amazing to see that it's finally coming. And some of the things that I've really been wanting for Red Dead Redemption on PC is more specifically like uh, upscaling technology like FSR 2 and DLSS because I know with Red Dead Redemption 1, when they came when it came out on the PS5, um, it had 60 FPS and it also came with AMD FSR um, upscaling, which worked surprisingly well. So I have a feeling that they're going to bring that tech over to the PC version while also including DLSS. Now, whether or not the game will look completely different, I don't think it's going to. It's probably going to look the same, if anything. I don't really see the graphics or the textures being improved to where it's like remake standards given that this game is well is long overdue for a pc port so everything that is you know being said in this leak i just think that it's going to be more of a basic bitch port than like a full-on technological port like they've done with gta 5 and red dead redemption 2 because you know every time they port their games to pc they always like to include the best technologies that they can because I feel their, their, their process recently has been drop game on PC, oh, sorry, on console for a year or two, and then release the PC version with like all the, you know, up to date uh, technology and also continuously update it over time to include anything extra if they feel like they can add it. 
Like Red Dead Redemption 2 was a perfect example of this where they include a lot of um, newer technologies um, when it came out, such as FSR and DLSS, but more so DLSS, um, which I think was... Actually, I didn't even know if FSR is in RDR2. I know DLSS is because I use DLSS whenever I play it, but that's really cool. So yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video talking about this. I'm very excited for RDR on PC. I hope that Rockstar does end up announcing it after I make this video just to finally get new players um into the franchise because i feel like a lot of people on pc have probably played red dead redemption 2 and it's it's fair because red dead redemption 2 is a prequel and red dead redemption rdr1 sorry is technically the sequel to to rdr2 so if you play red dead redemption 2 you don't have to worry about playing the first game but for those that have never experienced the first game or don't have like a console to try and experience it you know it's a great opportunity for Rockstar to get a bunch of players, you know, back into the series, but also play RDR1 for the first time because, you know, it is one of the best games ever made. I love RDR1 so much. It's such a good game. So yeah, that's about it. I'll have more coming for you soon. Peace.